Um, I want to provide a quick lesson in uh, the power of context and the uh, unfortunate results of of uh, context dropping and uh, doing non secretaries in one's uh, uh, thinking and behavior, or also uh, and also uh, acquiring uh, knowledge in the process of acquiring knowledge about someone, something, uh, etc. So, as as you should know. It's, uh, it's very easy to get a first impression, especially, uh, of uh, somebody you don't know well enough, you haven't had the in-person or uh, long, long enough video conversation to know what this person is about, how this person can be in a relaxed conversation. And, and of course, otherwise. And I'm a prime example of this. Um, I have always had this really, really powerful gift of the gab, of public speaking, of singing, of song and dance also. And I can, on a dime, change my acting, my behavior, my conversation style, pitch, velocity, inertia. To be very, very quiet, soft, and cuddly. I like cotton now. Where you think I'm just a cute little fluffy cat or fluffy rabbit. To just be begged to be hugged, played with. to talk about and decry what really needs to be said and done, starting with me first. And then hopefully inspiring other people to do so. Prime example, if you do spend as much or enough time like me in knowing about the demographic winter, especially in Western Europe, you would know already that <clears throat> much of the white race over there feels so much guilt, has been brainwashed so much for so many decades 
that they are, are <coughs> a sexist, misogynist, racist, Nazis, and they are responsible for uh, poverty in the world because somehow they have supposedly uh, stolen all the wealth from Africa and poor people. They have stolen it. They have just ripped it, ripped the wealth from their hands as opposed to having it created through free enterprise. So these, uh, the, white, the white race, basically, in, in much of Western Europe and many other parts of the world, they have, they, they have abandoned much, almost all of them, all of them, almost all of them have abandoned completely to fight back, fight back to preserve their, their civilization, the wealth, the real wealth, the real uh, inventions, uh, values, and products and services, ideas from thousands of years ago. They have abandoned to protect that. They have been crippled, crippled by an unearned, <coughs> unearned guilt that has been foisted on them for centuries now, I think. And, and of course, unearned guilt goes both ways. So as you may be, you remember, earlier today, uh, mm, I made a short post in the, uh, in the Freedom Man Radio group saying something along the lines if you don't donate at a fraction just at a, just a fraction of, of my donation level which is $50 per month you probably suck and of course it's impossible to know exactly that's why I'm a stickler for language Remember, I use the word fraction and probably, you probably suck a fraction of $50 per month. And oh boy, oh boy, as I expected, as I, as I expected, so many, uh, so many trolls and people have self, self exposed themselves by objecting for me using the word suck. Uh, and so, and it turned out to be a very long thread. It's still going on. So in the context of this incredibly urgent life and death, uh, completely, utterly life and death, urgency and context sensitive video, that uh, my post is a result of uh, Steph's uh, uh, donation-based video that he put out recently. So many people in the thread, in the group, preferred to focus on me using strong, aggressive, arrogant words, uh, abrasive words, Explicit, black and white. Uh, type of uh, wording in a short post. They prefer to latch on to that, to object. Because their feelings, their sensibilities uh, was triggered. Was, uh, it's like a, 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 a spark, sparked into, oh, annoyance. Ah, oh, I feel annoyed, irritated. Ah. Oh. I suck because I really, really suck because I don't donate at all or uh, not even at a fraction of $50 per month. Oh, I got to I gotta fight back. I'm going to push back like a real parasite, like a real leech, like a real mosquito, like a real bug and a fly in a wall, like a real leftist, like fake Jake Taper, CNN, and the mainstream uh, uh, news. So, fuck your feelings. Those feelings of those people that were triggered. That was the point, man. This was to self-expose you out. 
of the group. Or, or to instantly make you pause and think for a moment or stand back or read it aloud and slowly my post so that hopefully you will reorganize you will look squarely in the eye your budget your financial budget if you have any i hope you have any one right if you don't get with it so that you will squarely look at your budget and reorganize because i sure damn know that so many of you are addicted to all kinds of very expensive activities, namely video games, uh, um, uh, pornography, uh, all kinds of other active activities where you spend, you spend much more than $10 per month on, I'm sure. And, and uh, many of it is food, food that you do not prepare, you do not cook for yourself. Like in a big batch, on, on a day that you have the most time in a week, you cook that up and you, you put that in small, dozens of small little containers, you freeze that, you put it in the fridge, and you have that at the ready to eat when you go out to your home for your job, career, or vacation. So many of you, I know, hey, you go to Starbucks. You buy, you buy with taxes on, on top of all that. Coffee, Starbucks and here and there, food, take out pizza, you know? And you say, oh, it's just every now and then, you know? I do not do it every day or every week. So what? It, it adds up. It adds up a lot, man. You know, this is just child's play, man. You know, you should be smart enough to understand all this, man. If you're in this group, if you don't make a weird group, you should know all this already, right? So yeah, fuck your feelings, man. <laughs> oh my goodness. Like, like, uh, like so many of the people that you supposedly admire have said many times over. Alex Jones, Paul Jeff Watson, Mike Cernovich and Steph. More than ever, it's time to use strong words. And any, 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 any other means that are non a u p b breaking to push back to advance the cause of protecting or or rather slow down the destruction of western civilization more than ever but apparently there is still so many of you that are oh mommy mommy this Strange on the internet has hurt my feelings. Ah, I am losing my brain. God, what am I gonna do? As opposed to growing thick fucking skin, physically and mentally. And of course, a quick side note suggestion uh, for those that are easily, easily triggered with strong words, strong criticism. Be it your family members or me stranger on the internet i suggest you learn to start uh, uh, lifting simple heavy weights by just picking up anything that is convenient enough in your home in your home in your life it could be like a, a take a take a just a briefcase fill it with heavy stuff or, or uh, what is it called? 10, 5 gallon liter water jugs. And even just with one at a time. And, we, and you walk with it. You walk, out, you walk outside with it on the, uh, or in your home, if you're too embarrassed to, to, to feel powerful and, and uh, show people you're strong by work, uh, walking outside your home. And it's called basically the farmer's walk. You just walk upright. It's the most technically devoid, simple, easy, physical human movement that you can do. So you take walking, just walking, which is an unloaded movement, and you may you transform it into a loaded carry type of movement by carrying in one or two hands, and you can alternate with two hands and then 
with one hand on each side. Why with one hand on each side sometimes? It's to work the, the core muscle, the oblique muscle, which is, you know, the ab, you know, like, so like uh, around your, uh, which is basically your belly and, and the sides. And so you walk, you, all, you do that. One to two times a week. And you, you progress, you do periodically, you take baby steps, walk, walk for a few hundred yards total, and then you wait. If you never did it before, you wait. The next day and the next two days, see, see how sore you are, if at all, especially in your shoulders, your traps. And then if, you're, if you don't feel sore at all, do it again with longer, uh, with, uh, longer walk and especially with a little bit more weight. And then when you feel your uh, next day or two after that, you're, you feel you are sore a little bit, well, continue doing that, that, that length and that amount of weight until you're not sore anymore, shoulders uh, and, or, uh, and so on. And then you, you can maintain that. And yeah, I'll tell you what it, what it does, man. It will give you so much well-being, better blood flow to your brain. <laughs> and have more of a stand-up, upright position, mentally, physically, you, your posture, your mental posture will be much better because your physical posture will be so much more straight. You will maintain or you will create, if you don't have one already, a much better help to your curvature of your posterior chain of your spine. <laughs> but enough about, about that, eh? Um, uh, so I, I'm not going to apologize. I won't apologize. And I have nothing to apologize for. Triggering all these people and the trap. Because it's about goddamn time that we... we we have more self-leaders as opposed to have, having just Paul Joseph Watson, Alex John, Maestronovich, and Steph, and so many others, Lauren Southern, and I could go on and on. I, I want to keep this not too long, this uh, video, because I can talk all the fucking day. That's how much energy I have. And I'm 49 and a half. How, how about that? Do you know that? <laughs> Yeah, on that little tidbit though, okay? On being 49 and a half. And you can, after this video, you can ask me lots of questions. Question, like a machine gun if you want. Ask me lots of questions. Why 49 and a half? I'm faster, stronger, healthier, sleep better. I have better cardio conditioning. I have much, much stronger abs. I sleep much better. Essentially, everything is better in my life, except my eyes, which now, they are pretty much almost as good as any time in my past. They won't ever be. But because I got laser eye surgery, oh man, did that ever change things around. But other than that, fuck yeah, man. It is possible to slow down the aging process in many ways if you do many of the stuff that I do and other stuff that I don't do, that I could do if I had a bigger financial budget and time and stuff like that. And of course, depending on what your genetics are and so yours Genetics is not necessarily my genetics, okay? So, yeah! So, fuck your feelings! And, of course, I hope you understand. No, I don't hope, but if you're smart enough, you will understand that expressions like, fuck your feelings, is like uh, Alex Jones says often, it is satire in, to a great extent. To drive the plane home that I'm trying to make. So, if you like this, subscribe to my channel and like this video and share it forward. Oh, yeah, one of the things though is uh, that I do not use my real name of all my activities online. That's why also I feel much more free to speak freely. All right. See you next time.